This week on Mail Call, we're covering the Streamlight TLR RM2. Look, we all know Streamlight. They make flashlights. They make flashlights you can hold in your hand. They make flashlights you can put on top of your head. And they make flashlights you can put on your gun. And of course, the weapon lights are my favorite because I love anything that goes on, in, around, or loosely associated with a firearm. First thing you're gonna notice, this is not a one inch tube with a bezel popping out of it like everyone else is doing. This is a nice low profile boxy shape. It's almost like they took a pistol light and like stretched it out. You got two CR123s in there. You have thumb activation, nice ergonomic thumb activation. If you were left handed and wanted to use your thumb, you'd put it on the right hand side of the gun. Of course, if you're right handed, other side, unless you got like Les Claypool fingers. But if you don't want to do the thumb activation, you also have remote switch activation. And there's just a jack in the back, goes in and out. It is noteworthy that they operate independently of each other. So if you rip off your tape switch or something like that, or frayed cables, so that works and that works. All right, in terms of activation and using it, you saw here, you have a temporary, you just press it and let go. You have to hold it for like more than a half second. I think it's in the manual. You guys can look it up. But if you just tap it and go away, it is a constant on. This is very similar to how they've been moving their weapon light activations as well. Streamlight also listens to feedback. All right, one of the things I used to always do with Streamlights is accidentally turn on the strobe function. The TLR RM2 does have a strobe function. There's also a lockout to prevent inadvertent accidental white light discharges you're out on patrol, you're out in dark, you don't want your light turning on in the middle. So it's easy and you can visibly and physically feel it when the light is off. All it takes is rotating the basil and you can feel this right here, these little crenulations with your fingers. And now we are back on. Oh, and I forgot to mention, this is a thousand lumen weapon light. That is kind of like the new modern baseline for a general purpose, general use weapon light. The TLR RM2 is just a pretty good general purpose weapon light. If you're looking for something like that with a smaller form factor without having a big old honking bezel, man, have a look at the TLR RM2 by Streamlight.